Hello everybody, Rex Tempest, Time Traveler here, coming at you another episode of Minecraft Story Mode. And we're playing through episode 5, Order Up, where we have to build ourselves onto a sky island from the ground. And yeah, we ended up down there last episode, thanks to some bad people from our own world. This will present it kind of like we're in a different dimension, but oh my gosh, look how fast I'm building. And I have to get back to... oh... Wow. We need to get in there now. Yeah, go, 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 it's go, under go, attack go. by gas. Look out. And... Oh, oh, okay. Uh, get inside. Oh, that was crazy. You okay? <gasps> what have they done? I think you can see what they've done, but I, I go to me and like, why have they done this? Who went? Ah! Okay. So, this is Aiden and the Blaze Rods, Lucas's old friends from like the first. Episodes. And they have released all of these monsters. Help me! He needs our help. All right, better get to work. And Q, ha ha. And ah. Okay, okay I don't have to fight them all by myself. What is going on here? The city is under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. All right, so we have to get inside the palace. Oh. Come on, we need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, man. Hey. All right, I gotta save my friends. I saw that they're like still actively throwing eggs, causing more and more problems. What are they trying to do? All right, everybody, let's go. And oh, spider jockey. I guess I'll take care of the spider part of this. And, okay, good. You are very quick on your feet. Thank you. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Hey, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. Alright, I don't know what the other side is, but we gotta get there and at least still make sure that they're not throwing eggs. Uh, no, eggs. Jerks. Petra! Okay. Jesse! You're alive? Uh, okay, well, nope. Don't hit me. Um, let me hit the back. Hi, Vor! Ah. Aiden has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! You need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. Ooh. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. One. Think you could hook me up with a potion of leaping? Here! Alright, and here we go. And... Oh. <laughs> Whoa, that's an awesome jump. Alright. So, where do I go from here? I'll go down this hole and aha! Back down and get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the founder! Yeah? Well, you're gonna be next if you don't shut up! Now you listen here! I'm the captain of- This is between you and me, Aiden. Leave <laughs> Reginald out of it. I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! Is the founder with you? <laughs> what? Hey! What? Alright. Reginald! Oh, man. Not one more step! What? I killed you once! I could do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Ha ha! Just die already! No, thank you. Should have left while you had the chance. Um, there's wood everywhere. This is a bad idea. No! Uh, oh. Ah! I missed. Oh! Okay. Uh, look out! This was supposed to be my world, and you ruined it. Listen to yourself. That's insane. Yeah, there are other people who already have this Why world in there. And yeah, yeah. Haha. <laughs> I just leave. 
Go away. Nobody wants you here. Whoa! Get back here! Another one! Uh out. And dodge. And oh wait. Yep. Oh the ray. Uh, Alright. So I gotta go out there I guess and take on Aiden. Maybe I can kick him over the edge. Uh, we should be pretty easy, I hope. Just come out here. And how you doing, Aiden? Don't worry about me. I'm just here to protect you just everybody can't stand else. To see someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. It's it not just that. You crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, I am gonna kick your butt. I can't wait to see you try. Haha. -ha. Okay. Haha! Ah. And attack! And dodge! And attack or block, I guess. Alright, come on! Let's go and uh Go! Get out of here! And again! Whoa! Would you, you asked me to die already? What about you? Got the dodge. Got, ha ha! Oh yeah. Oh, even better. Wait, wait, wait! Hang on, hang on. I, I, I surrender. I surrender. Uh, we can talk about this, right? I don't know. Here, here. You want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it. It's yours. Oh. Just please, don't hurt me. All right, so I gotta pick up the flint and steel because I definitely need that if I want to get back home. We didn't find a portal that'll take us back. You did it, Jesse. We need to get out of here. Uh, all right. What do you want to do with him? Um. Please, this place is getting worse by the minute. You can't just leave me here. Take me with you. After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. All right. Get moving. You're coming with us. Th th thank you. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly. I, I mean, I couldn't just... I have to be the hero. All right. Um. Oh. Water. We can use that to get everybody to the ground safely. All right. And stay there. Oh, look out. Whoa! You retrieved the Eversource. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together. All right, so let's just everybody Jesse, just jump in the water. Yeah, I Jesse, don't, here I am. The situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. If we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. I guess we could jump for it. Waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. Somebody we'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just right. watch me and follow my lead, okay? Yeah, see, I'll go first. Come on. Um, so I just what, walk forward and aha, there we go. And just swim forward. Eventually the water's gonna take me, right? Come on, everybody. Let's go. Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. Good, somebody listen. Uh -huh. And we're oh the iron golem's coming with us too. Oh, uh, Guys, look out! And, oh, hopefully got knocked into the water. All right, here we go, and <laughs> over the edge. And here we are. Aha! Yeah. Okay, so made it safely. Let's get ourselves to shore. And here comes everybody. Oh, the chicken. come on, chicken! 
You are lying. There's ground everywhere. You thought I was lying? Ugh. Jesse, I cannot thank you enough. You've saved us all. Yeah, you could try to thank me enough. What do we do now? Punch a tree. Everything's just so different and scary. Well, let me tell you, Reggie. First thing you need to do is go get yourself some wood. How, uh, how do I do that? You find a tree and then you just start punching. Everybody knows that when you first start a Minecraft world. You start by punching a tree. Oh, Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere! I knew you'd stop him. Nice work. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. What goes around comes around, am I right, guys? Alright, so yeah, they're prisoners. Kinda build a... Aiden. Jail for them or something. Oh, uh... Hi, Jesse. I'm... Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. Uh, I've, uh... Got some regrets, to say the least. I hope you learned a lesson, Aiden. This didn't have to happen like this. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah. That's for sure. Hmm. Try and make a fresh start, okay, Aiden? Do something good for these guys. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Make myself a little house. Maybe I'll become a writer. Okay. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Good. Well, that's settled. Attention! Huh? Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free. Build whatever we please. Wow. Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Mm. Hey, both of you, fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win. Oh, yeah. of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves. Be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! Well, what do we do? Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. You're welcome. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. This is a second chance at making a civilization. Don't waste it, okay? I don't intend to. I give my solemn oath. Okay, so they're on the right path, working together. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but she's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Mm. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. Mm -hmm. No, you didn't. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. All right, so, oh. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yes, that's a rather nice notion. How would you like to go explore some of those, um, very tall vertical rocks? We call them mountains, usually. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. 
After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend. Benedict. Ah, that's a boy's name. Huh, <laughs> what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token uh. of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, All right. there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Ah, uh, where you been? Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Eh, uh, no, I just saw those pigs. You know. Oh, yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. Probably. Alright, so we just have to get safely down into the hole in the ground where the portal is. See? Just like I told you, one portal back home. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. <laughs> Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Hmm. Come on, guys. Let's go home. And light it up with this and haha. -ha. Excellent, Olivia here will be fed. You'll never believe. All right. So back yeah. home and that's not what I was expecting. What? That? Oh. Wow, that's a lot of portals. Okay. All right, so this has been the end of this particular episode, episode five, order up of Minecraft Story Mode. I do want to say thank you for watching. We'll be back next week with the next chapter, chapter six. Until then, thanks and bye.